exponential functions. Sam's investment of $3,000 has been decreasing in value at a rate of 1.5% each year. What will his investment be worth in five years? Now here we have an example of exponential function and let us see how to solve this. So what we are given here is the principal amount of $3,000 and depreciation rate is 1.5% or 1.5 over 100, right? Which be 0 0.015. Now looking into this, at any instance of time, we can say amount after n number of years will be how much? The principal amount times 1 minus, since it is depreciating at this rate, 0 0.015 to the power of n. So that becomes the amount after any fixed time period, right? So what we can do is we can type of simplify it. You should need a calculator. So we'll do 1 minus 0 0.015 and that gives you in decimals 0 0.985 right to the power of n so that is the general formula now what will his investment be worth in five years that means if n is five what is the amount so we say amount after five years is equals to the principal amount of 3000 which is 3000 right times 0 0.985 to the power of 5, correct? So we can now calculate this. So we have 0 0.985 to the power of 5, and we'll multiply that by 3,000 to get the answer, which is equal to 27, 81.649. So we can write this as 65. So that is the value. 2781, right, I wrote it wrong. So that is the value after five years. So our answer is, it is dollars 2781.65 after five years, right? In this equation, since we know that the principal is 3000, we should have written 3000, 0 0.985 to the power of n, correct? So that is how we can solve these questions. Thank you.